Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Kiki with RK and start of a new vlog on a Saturday. Okay, on time this time. And I'm filming a podcast episode today. Yeah, you can see I have like yarn right there and stuff and I have like projects right there and yeah, I still need to get everything together. But before I film for that, I need to edit today's video. Also, my calendar just reminded me that tomorrow time changes. <sighs> like what? I I forgot. I think what time first changed like in November or something. So it has been a while, but it doesn't feel like it. First of all, it doesn't even feel like it's March. Like this year just started and it's just it's just flying. I feel like I say this every single year, but every year suddenly like it's January and then suddenly we're in August and the next year is about to start like time flies. Anyway, yeah, so I'm going to edit this video, post it and then film for my podcast because it's <laughs> it's been a while. I have a lot to talk about and I'm excited for that one. And yeah, I think that's it right now. So I'm going to get to editing. It's currently 9.05 a.m. And I'm just gonna relax and do that. I want to work more on my cumulus tea. Hopefully by the end of this vlog I can finish the body of the cumulus tea. I'm not even gonna say the cumulus tea because I am knitting it on 3.25 millimeter needles and that is tiny. So I can't compare it to like my DK weight sweaters, my Monday sweater I'm wearing today because it's timeline is not the same at all so which, which is fine though I have a lot of progress on my cumulus tea and if you watch my podcast episode that's coming out on Monday because this one's coming out the end of that week basically you would have already seen my podcast so you would have seen the progress in my cumulus tea but anyway I keep yawning oh my gosh anyway let's just get it so I'm just gonna go ahead and start filming for my podcast it's 12 p.m. food is on its way I would rather get the filming out of the way and then eat be comfy and stuff like that yeah and I think we're going to the library today later today in a few hours yeah I believe that's the plan hopefully the rain doesn't interrupt that but we should be good and I can finally end out my other video that I've been filming for my writing channel. <sighs> finally. Anyway, yeah, let me, let me go film that now. All right guys, I just finished filming for my podcast and I forget how raw my throat feels after filming a podcast episode. So I'm gonna drink some water, I'm gonna eat some food, I'm gonna chill and then just knit for the rest of the day. Yeah, I think on my cumulus tea. We're going to the library because I need to film for my writing vlog. So I'm going to definitely knit there with my sea stars. Hello. Hello. Um, and yeah, we're gonna chill there. The library closes at five. So it's three. Oh, no, it's 2.39. We're supposed to leave at three, but Malika's like, I'm ready. So yeah, we have some time. We're not gonna stay there too long anyway, but yeah, when we get home, we are going are we gonna watch you when we get home yes we're gonna watch you when we get home oh my gosh the roads are so empty i love it i love the weekends and then maybe play some fortnite it depends anyway no, no? okay fine <laughs> bye bye <laughs> Hello, Ramona. 
I reach through mysterious ceilings, my only hope. I look for the things I don't know. Excuse me, bro. I'm so tired. So I usually wake up at 7 a.m. But because time started to spring forward, the now 7 a.m. is the former 6 a.m. So yeah, I was tired, but that's okay. My camera was literally zoomed in. Oops. Anyway, I have two videos to edit today, one for my writing channel, which I need to post tomorrow, and one for this channel, which is my podcast that I need to post tomorrow, but I really don't feel like editing right now, <laughs> but I have all day to edit, so I'm just gonna eat, chill, knit, watch knit vlogs and knit podcasts and knit videos in general just enjoy that and it also helped me get out of this like little sleep funk because if i start editing i'm gonna probably fall asleep <laughs> that's it i worked on my dress last my dress i worked on my skirt last night while oh while i watched you with my sisters oh my gosh oh my gosh we need another season of you the way they set that up I can take one more season. Give us one more season and then I'll be fine. I'll be satisfied, you know? But this one, it's so different from the others, which I really enjoyed, okay? I love a little murder mystery whodunit. Like, it's nice and slow, even though a lot of people didn't like how slow it was. They're like, oh my god, it's boring, it's slow, nothing's happening, nothing makes sense. Trust me, when you reach like season. I would say season, no, season what? When you reach like episode seven or eight or both, everything connects and it's just like, what just happened? What the heck just happened? And oh my gosh, I love the way it ended. It was crazy. It was great. I need another one. It was just so good. I really enjoyed it. Anyway. Do I have anything else to tell you guys? I don't think so. So I'll just see you later. When I tell you guys, I literally did not feel like doing anything yesterday. I knitted a little bit and then I read until like 3 p.m. And then I knitted until like 7. And then I played Fortnite with my sisters until 10 something. And then I went to bed reading. Got no editing done, even though I have two videos to edit for today. But I was just like, I'm not going to force myself. I'm not going to rush. If I want to take a little break, I deserve a break. Okay, so yesterday was nice and chill. Now it's time to actually do some work today. The project that I'm going to work on today is my cumulus tea. I really want to finish the body. So I've just been knitting on that. I got a lot of progress. I will show you guys later, hopefully, if I remember. I think that's it so I'll update you guys later. It is 11 20 a.m. right now and I am currently uploading my video so oh, well before 12 o'clock that feels great so now I'm just putting all the links and what do we call it timestamps in the description box so that's gonna take me just a little bit because I have a lot of links because I had a lot of finished objects and I talk about a lot of yarn so yeah that's what I'm doing right now and then when I'm done with that oh hallelujah I can start watching all the knitting podcasts that came out the past couple of days I have them loaded up in my tabs but it's time to get into it <laughs> editing that second video it's currently 8 29 oh this angle's weird oh well i don't care 
and no and nothing but i got some progress okay that was not a lot of progress i did not do a lot of knitting i just finished playing games with my siblings okay but you know here's a little oh my gosh no i did get a lot of progress i moved my stitch marker like a couple hours ago okay i got a lot of progress okay so this is the progress so far since i stopped playing games it's only, only been like I don't know how long it's been but I think I it's like right here I started today somewhere I don't know all I know is that I have like three inches left before I'm finished with this top this is the pro <gasps> that looks so good look at this look at it it's like hello <laughs> this is so exciting oh my gosh and three inches with this usually three inches will be like a nothing on a dk weight project but on one strand of fingering <laughs> yeah that's a lot of knitting still so instead of going to bed like early-ish like i usually do i'm just gonna keep watching through these knitting podcasts and videos and just knit. Yeah, I'll work on a skirt more just to get some progress and just give this give this tee a nice little break because I have been zooming through it. This isn't taking as long as I thought it would. Like, I feel like because I'm intentionally putting a lot of time into it so that it doesn't feel like it's taking long. And then with Kalila telling me to put a progress keeper so then I can, you know, keep track of my progress and it'll help motivate me it definitely does help motivate me oh my gosh I think I'm gonna start doing that with a bunch of my projects just to just to see how much I knit honestly I don't think I've done it since I started knitting so yeah I'll do that anyway that is all I have for you guys tonight I'll see you guys tomorrow where I'll knit more on the skirt. I'll edit this video for my writing channel and post it. <laughs> and yeah. Yeah, lots of knitting. gonna film earlier but it was like 7 20 and it was dark i love it i love waking up at my normal time and it being dark outside like yes i don't have to wake up at 6 a.m or anything to enjoy the darkness of the morning i just love it oh i forgot to change my battery Ooh. anyway i'm working on my skirt right now when i get some progress in that and then i'm going to i'm watching a bunch of knit videos and then i'm going to edit that video and post it finally okay that's it let me change my battery look at my progress on my skirt hold on bear with me boom so this is now reaching my knees which is great and i'm on stripe one two three four five six seven i'm on stripe eight out of it's gonna be in total 15 but i'll say 13 before i split for the slits because then the 15 will be when i start the split so my goal is to get to 13 not today okay it's not my goal for today if i do today that's great but i do have two inches of this left that i want to try to finish today like before i get to the i-cord bind off so I knitted this for, it's currently 11 right now, I was knitting on this for a couple of hours, so now I'm going to go to this project. Literally the entire time I was knitting this skirt, I was thinking about this, because I only have two inches left, so I'm just like, you know what, let me get into it and use most of the day to get to the I-cord and potentially start the I-cord. Oh, that would be so great. 
So yeah, I'm very excited. But I'm super excited that I got some nice progress in this skirt because I'm ready to start on the top and to see how that turns out. And yeah, so putting this away for now. Might might come back to it later today. Put this full counter in there. All right, time for this. This is my progress from yesterday. And I'm going to move it up today after I finish this round and get back to the beginning. So, yeah. Did I show you guys what it looks like? Probably, but here it is again. And then remember, this is also going to stretch when I block it because it is silk. So, yeah. I'm excited to see that. Oh my gosh, I was just thinking. How do you block silk? Do you block it? I was just over here thinking like, okay, when I'm blocking, da, 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 and I was just like, wait a minute. This isn't, this isn't like regular merino wool or wool or anything like, hmm, I don't know. Let me know what you guys do with like fibers, like cotton and silk and stuff like that. Of course, I'm going to look it up myself, but I would love to know what you guys do. If you do any blocking, like maybe steam blocking, I don't know. Maybe blocking for like five minutes wet blocking. I don't know. I didn't even think about not being able to wet block this. So yeah, let me let me know what you guys do. Because I would love some ideas. Guys, it is what time is it? 707 and I reached usually I would say the body ribbing, but the body I cord, I guess. So now I just need to change my needles to 2.5 millimeter needles, which I have because I use them for my socks and I happen to have the 32 inch or something like that. So that's perfect. And now I'm going to transfer my stitches onto there. And then, I mean, I watched how to do eye cord bind off. So I'm going to do that. <sighs> I'm so excited. I'm going to watch the video right before I do it, but I'm going to start it tonight just so I can know that I'm doing it correctly and see. So I'll have more motivation tomorrow. But let me show you what the, well, I have it on the front side. So you'll just see the back of the cumulus T, but I'll turn it after I show you the back. I'll show you the front after that. So yeah. I'm over here watching Monk. Oh, such a great show. Let me pause that. But here, okay. Here is my cumulus tee from the back. Oh my gosh. Look at these stitches. Oh, this fabric is so weird. But look at this. All right, this is what it looks like in the front. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Time to transfer my stitches. why it takes forever okay but you know it's turning out nicely I mean I think I'm doing it correctly like look at this can you see it hold on wait wait I think you can see it look at this you can tell when I started off here I was like noobish and like holding it tightly and now that I'm used to it I'm just like it like got looser not in a bad way but yeah that's cool. That's definitely taking forever, but the motion of it is so like repetitive and like therapeutic. It's just like, ah. So anyway, I'm putting this away from the, for the night, not from the night. For the night, I'm going to chill, get some reading done. It's like 9.22. So yeah.
guys. I cord. I like it. I really like it. Like, it's so different and enjoyable. Like, every time I do it, I'm like, I can't believe I'm doing this. Every time I saw I cord, it just seems so daunting. It seemed like it was really hard and it would take a while to grasp it, but literally, it's so easy. Anyway, I have a nice bit done. I still have a lot more to go, but I'm hoping to finish it by tonight. I know it's gonna take me all day. Sorry, my dad called me, I forgot what I was saying. I chord's great, anyway. I want, oh, no, I don't know. Anyway, today, I'm gonna make some waffles. It's currently 10.04 a.m. I've literally been working on this I chord <laughs> since 7.40 something this morning, and it's 10. And I also edited a video, so that took up some of my time as well. But I'm gonna make some waffles. I'm watching Monk right now, but I'm looking at my mom there at the store. They're getting groceries, I guess, and they got what I needed to make the waffles. So we have a waffle maker, if you guys didn't know. <music> part where I joined the I chord together to like finish it off is so bad but who cares because I am done Ding! this is so cool though I did it Whee! oh my gosh now that I know how to do it I know how I can make it even better Oh gosh, this is so great. I can't believe I did my, four, my first eye cord bite off. It's great. At least the one that's like raggedy is like kind of under the armpit, so that's okay. It looks pretty good. Of course it dips all the way down here. If I had big boobs, like you'll see my boobs, but I don't, so you don't see them. Look at the eye cord at the bottom, so it like hits this is my belly button right here, and this is like, oh my god, this is like perfect crop length. Like, I I want my tees to be like croppy, like just a little bit past my belly button crop length now. I don't need oversized tees, like, like as in like super long tees. I'm just like, I'm trying to get into the short, short sleeve, short... Like not super crop, but crop enough. I can't wait to figure out some way to block it. I think this video will be out before I like do any blocking. So definitely, like I said, let me know what you guys do when blocking material, yarn, fiber like this. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna take this off before I continue admiring it. So see ya. I did some knitting and I'm actually on the I-cord bind off for the sleeve. The sleeve didn't take long at all so hopefully I can finish binding off today because it's a small sleeve so the I-cord shouldn't take too long and then I can start on the second sleeve get like halfway through that. Oh, I'm almost done with this top. Yeah, and I can finish this definitely before the month ends. I thought it would take me all month because it's on 3.25 millimeter needles. So, that's great. I can definitely, definitely start my Cumulus Tea dress sometime next week. Yeah, 
But then what else do I want to have on a needles? Because that one's going to be like a longish term project. So yeah, I just need to figure out what I want to do next. Actually, after I finish it, I can finish these socks. I can work on this weekend hat, finish that as well. I do still have the skirt and the top that I need to work on. So yeah, I'll just finish off those projects while I'm knitting on the Cumulus T dress. And then, oh, next on my list, I have the camisole number six by My Favorite Things Knitwear and the shorts number one. So those two will go together. So yeah. I need to finish, I want to finish the socks, the weekend hat, and the maxi skirt first. Yeah. Before I start on the camisole number six. So, never mind. I forgot I had a bunch of projects already. <laughs> But I just like to plan ahead, 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 you know? Yeah. Guys, this is the sleeve. It, like, doesn't really touch my elbow, but it's like, you know, elbow length, I guess. And I didn't decrease because, I don't know, the sleeve is already small. I wouldn't want to decrease it. Anyway, I'm thinking, I don't know. I kind of like this wide neckline, how it goes all the way down here. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It's making me not really want to do the eye cord option for the neckline, but it all depends. Mm, depends on how I'm feeling, because this is going to be more like a, a house shirt-ish, I guess. And like, oh, sometimes if I wear it out, I'll put like a long sleeve t-shirt or a t-shirt under it or something I don't know but I like the real casual homey look about it without the eye cord and then it's less work for me as well hmm we shall see we'll see <laughs> is screaming because why nothing I'm not even screaming we came to the bank to take care of some business with our dad and stuff and she didn't bring her knit project I don't see your knit she project she stole anywhere. my purse with prove it <laughs> exactly she stole my purse with my cumulus tea but she didn't bring a project our dad is on the phone right now so we're just chilling he has to take care of some stuff we're stranded here we are not stranded. Yes, we are. For sure. You have a purse, bro. I don't have your purse. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> La di 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 da. La di 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 da. Fine. Next. 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 Old. It's 50 degrees and it's cold. <laughs> I hope tomorrow is warmer. The high is 72. It went up to 72. Something it was good. 70 at first. First it was 69, then it was 70. Now it's 72. <laughs> yeah. We're good. We're, We're good. good. I'm excited. Starting a new vlog tomorrow. Eek. Yep, Saturday 20. Why would I say 22? 72 and then at 2 p.m. it'll be 71. Oh beautiful that's awesome. When we leave it'll be 67 which is still hot. Yeah that's fine. Yeah. Anyway. Toodles guys. Finally, I'm able to eat breakfast at, oh, 
I thought it was like afternoon, bro. It's just 10, 13. Ah! We're gonna eat some oatmeal. Cause it's such a, ooh, that was hard. It's such a great, basic, simple meal to eat for breakfast. Anyway, then I'll continue with my sleeve. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I finish it today. Malika plans on staying up tonight, so I'll probably try to get most of it done for this video and then spend the rest of the night editing and stuff. That'd be great. Okay, anyway, toodles. Oh my gosh, I took so, such a long break. But where am I? <sighs> Needle slippers. I took a long break, but I'm on an I cord part of this top, and I decided I'm just gonna end up this vlog here and just finish it off camera because I really want to start putting all the clips together for this video and stuff so I can begin my editing. But yeah, that's it for this video. By the time the next one starts, I won't be done with it, but I will be finishing it and then starting on the cumulus dress, you know, the cumulus top into a dress with my, can you guys see? I don't know if you can see. I have a blue willy knit cone. I'll talk more about it in my next vlog. And I also talked about it in my podcast. If you guys haven't seen that, you should check it out. Yeah, so I'm going to knit that into my blue willy knit cone. I'm going to finish off my skirt. Try to finish this sock. Maybe even my hat. I have a bunch of whips, okay? Like, granted, small ones. But I really want to get through those whips just so I can start a new collection of whips new socks new beanie new projects in general so that's all i have for you guys thank you so much for watching let me know what you guys worked on while watching this video i would love to know don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button and click that notification bell because it will notify you guys whenever i post another video and also don't forget to follow me on instagram because that's where i'll update you guys on any and everything that i'm knitting my yarn and life and everything so yeah follow me there and I'll see you guys in the next one.